Greetings, I'm Francis Fran Japan. If I could just take a moment with you. You know, our world is filled with fearsome things. There are conditions unfolding, even biblical prophecies of, of end time events that are in the headlines of our newspapers. The world has become a very fearful place. It's become unpredictable. And, and how will that affect us? And how will we get from point A to point B? How will we get from this day to that day when we give our lives fully to the Lord in, in death and in resurrection? How will we make our life an act of glory to God? Well, as a man of God, as a pastor, I've worked with people and I've also found in my own soul places uh, where I was vulnerable to the enemy. The Lord, though, has helped me to find the spiritual equivalent of the Goshen that was a place of protection for Israel and Egypt, that there is such a place for Christians, and that's the presence of the Lord. And I don't mean kind of the ethereal presence of the Lord, but the Bible speaks of an actual place called the shelter of the Most High, a place where the principles of God's Word, where the revelation of God's help, where the doctrines of His personal attention and functionality in our lives can insulate us and protect us, can become a stronghold for us to hide in and to move through life, no matter what the challenge is, no matter what the battle, no matter what the fearsome thing is that is standing in front of us, God has created a place where the evil one touches us not, where we can be positioned in the Lord, separated and protected from the things around us. The Word says that in these days, men's hearts will be failing for fear at the things coming upon the world. I want to invite you, friend, to find the shelter of the Most High. I want to invite you to, to begin to seek the Lord. And I would like to, to present to you the opportunity to go to your Christian bookstore or go online, go to our website and, and get a hold of this book. This book, I believe, changed my life. The truths in it are, are things that have helped me get through battles that were meant to destroy me. God has used it to help and enrich and empower me. And I want to offer the same thing to you. Please consider your life, your need, or somebody that you know that, that uh, you love is going through a battle. This will help. God bless you. Thank you for your time.